Hello, my name is my name is Danny. Today I'm gonna to be doing a tutorial about uh, how to switch out the memory in your computer, in your Mac. You have a Mac here. I'm gonna show you how to switch out the memory. Uh, well, first, before we get started, you're gonna need some string. You're gonna need one of these special Mac tools to help get the memory out. If you don't have one of those, you can you can get some giant scissor clipper things. Um, you're gonna need a, a pipe cutter. Um, a level, probably, and then maybe a, a little tiny screwdriver thing, um, some pliers, and I like to use a cement chisel. You know, if it's giving me any trouble, I'll just bring out the cement chisel. Um, and then also um, a giant, weird, rusty, uh, Cambodian, uh, African knife, knife thing. All right, uh, and then to get it back together, if you lose any of the little screws or anything, you'll need a staple gun, staple hammer gun. All right, now, again, I'm a professional, um, so I'm probably gonna go too fast for you. You're probably gonna have to pause this and whatnot, but let's just get to it. Welcome to the Gradual Report, where we gradually report. First thing you wanna do is flip your computer over and take your battery. Now you do that by pushing down on these two things and your battery just pops out, right? Your RAM memory is actually under this platform. Now there there were three screws here. Before we started, I went ahead and took the, uh, the screws out with this so that we can, boom, see? This here is, is the, uh, the RAM memory card. Get the RAM memory card out. What you're gonna need is uh, these pliers here. Um, and just kind of, just grab onto them. That's, yeah, it's not working. Let me uh, get these cutters. I'm just gonna, just gonna cut them here. Just, just dash and cut. There we go. Okay, there, I got it, I got it. All right, now they just pop right out when you do that. Now that I saw how easy that one was, probably just gonna use the same scissor technique, you know? And um, uh, that's it. So there you go, you took out the RAM cards. This one's broken a little. It's not that big a deal. What you can do is just spit on it like that um, and stick that back on there, you know? Get some string and just wrap that with some string and then use your pipe cutters um, to cut the string, or if you don't have pipe cutters, then your giant African knife. You can also cut the string with that. Um, all right, then you get your new RAM cards, which should look exactly like this, and you just slide them in. Now, if they don't fit right, you know, if they don't slide in and then just push down and they lock in, if they don't lock in, like mine's a little sticky, then you just wanna take the giant African knife and just kind of hammer it, you know, with that. Um, now another cool thing I'm going to show you real quick while I got you here is when you have your laptop, like I've got mine here, if you have your keys and you get some stuff in between the keys, you can use the giant African knife, you know, to just just, uh, just, to, just to get the stuff out from in between the keys, you know, and then just dig into it a little, a little bit like that. See, look at all this. Look at all these little rubber pieces. All these little rubber pieces and stuff, they were in between the keys. Now I can type on the computer and there's no problem at all. The keys aren't sticking, there's no problem. My mouse, my mouse, wait, what? My mouse button gets stuck sometimes? Giant African knife, not a problem. Yeah, let me just poke on that a little. Jesus, that felt like it went right through the computer into the floor. Yeah, it did, holy Christ. What, my speakers? The speakers don't work, you just take them with, with your bare hand and just rip them out. I don't even know what this is. That's just, I don't even know what that is. Really, honestly, does anyone know what that is? No one does, you know? Right, look, here's my screen. Check this screen out. Uh, Oh, look at that. It's, it's like liquid or something in there. No one, no one really knows what's going on in there. This is called a motherboard. The thing I'm tapping here with my giant African blade knife. And then you can get your chisel out. Here's the hard drive. This is the part that fails on you. When this takes a shit on you, you lose everything. And the genius bar 
but they don't, they probably, this probably will void your warranty, but just, just hammer that hard drive with your, uh, with your rusty cement, just hammer on it, give me back my photos, give me back my photos, you piece of shit! Anyway, um, yeah, so, just put it back together, get some string, tie some string around it, and good as new, buddy. It is not level, friends. Final summation, I don't know how to fix computers worth a goddamn. Leave some comments about going back to school, and maybe they'll show up in the show. All right, my little lemon drops. All right.